when did music become a part of, of, of their lives? Was, was that a dream of yours? Was, was that something that you saw that could protect them even more? Well, that came from me being involved with some type of music and things and rehearsing and maybe standing around listening and looking. And uh, when I bought my instruments, and my, my wife used to sort of like scold me about buying so many instruments because I kind of want them involved with it as well. And so, and so um, after being in, them involved with the instruments, Tito used to play my guitar and all that stuff, and, and uh, he learned how to play pretty good. And then the group, my wife would rehearse them a lot too, but she found out they were in good harmony when they sing and the one is playing the guitar and the one is playing the bongos and stuff. So it was making a little noise. Was there a moment, Mr. Jackson, where you, you looked at your kids or, or maybe it was Tito first and, and maybe Jermaine or all of them and you said, you know what, there's something really special about my boys. Like, these aren't regular boys. There's, there's some talent there. Well, I saw the talent there, but, and they were learning real good. But when Michael got involved with singing with them and all that type of thing, I really saw the real talent there because he was doing things, spinning and dancing and all that stuff, which most, uh, you know, most artists get on stage when they get ready to perform. It's one foot to the other and they don't, they, you know, they don't have any magic in what they're doing on stage. Mm -hmm. But Michael had it all, you know. He was learning. He must have been rehearsing a little bit, you know, off to the side when no one was looking. But he was very good at dancing and spinning and doing the split. You know, they, back then they were doing the split. The, you the know? James yeah. Brown split. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But uh, he learned real fast. So you, you saw magic in Michael. I saw magic in all of them with Michael leading. Yeah, leading the songs. Yeah. When did you know? What, do you remember their first performance? Like when you when you took them out in front of people? Obviously, there must have been a lot of performances in the living room first, or in the house. The first performance I'm um, looking at was uh, back then was at a, at a talent show, you know, and and, and I think it was a steel town that uh, I signed uh, a six months contract with. But we were doing a lot of talent shows before the Steel Town, before signing up the Steel Town. And we were winning all of the talent shows. Everyone has one of them. And we, all over Illinois, we winning talent shows and all that type of thing. Then we started playing the clubs, you know. And that's what happened, nightclubs, things of that sort. Let me read a quote that, that Michael said. He said, I thought this was interesting. He said, talent is something God gives to a performer. But my father taught us how to cultivate. I thought that was a nice thing. Where'd you get that from? That's, that's the first time I heard of it. That's, 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 that's out of his book. That's out of his book.